in the small, secluded town of Raven's Hollow, nestled deep within the shadows of an ancient forest, a group of friends shared an extraordinary secret. Born with an inexplicable ability, they possessed the power to transform into animals at will. Their strange gift had bound them together since childhood, creating an unspoken pact that kept their supernatural abilities hidden from the prying eyes of the ordinary world. One gloomy autumn evening, as the moon hung low and obscured by heavy clouds, the friends gathered at the edge of the forest. The air was thick with an eerie stillness, and the trees seemed to whisper ancient secrets to those who dared to listen. The friends, fueled by a combination of curiosity and the thrill of their extraordinary abilities, decided to venture deeper into the heart of the forest than ever before. As they navigated the dense underbrush, their senses heightened with the anticipation of the unknown. Shadows danced in the moonlight, and the crunch of fallen leaves beneath their feet echoed ominously through the darkened woods. The chilling breeze carried with it whispers that seemed to call their names from the depths of the ancient trees. As the group reached a clearing, they exchanged nervous glances. The moonlight revealed a forgotten altar, its stone surface adorned with cryptic symbols, partially concealed by overgrown vines. A lingering mist began to snake its way through the clearing, swirling around the friends like ghostly fingers. The atmosphere shifted abruptly, and an unsettling unease settled upon them. Their animal instincts kicked in, causing fur to bristle and feathers to ruffle. In the unnatural stillness, a distant sound emerged, a haunting melody that seemed to echo from the heart of the forest. It resonated with an otherworldly cadence, a tune that spoke to the primal instincts within each of them. With an unspoken agreement, the friends transformed into their animal forms, seeking comfort in the familiarity of fur and feathers. But as the haunting melody intensified, so did the unease that gripped them. The forest, once a sanctuary, now harbored a malevolent presence that stirred in the shadows. In their animal forms, the friends felt an instinctual fear, a primal understanding that they were not alone in the darkness. As the haunting melody reached a crescendo, a spectral figure emerged from the depths of the forest, a shadowy entity with glowing eyes that seemed to pierce through the veil of reality. The friends, frozen in their animal forms, watched in terror as the figure approached, its ghostly form weaving between the ancient trees. The melody resonated with a dark magic, binding them to the clearing, where the forgotten altar pulsed with an ominous energy. The night had just begun, and Raven's Hollow held secrets darker than the forest itself. The friends, trapped in their animal forms, faced a nightmare that transcended the boundaries of their extraordinary abilities. The melody of the forest whispered of ancient rituals and unspeakable horrors. And as the friends trembled in the moonlit clearing, the true nature of their supernatural gift unraveled in the face of a malevolent force that hungered for more than their animal forms. The spectral figure, its form shifting like smoke in the moonlight, extended a shadowy hand toward the friends. A shiver ran through the air, freezing the very essence of their animal selves. The haunting melody now seemed to emanate from the figure itself, a dark symphony that resonated with the hidden depths of the forest. As the figure approached, the friends felt an inexplicable connection to the altar. It pulsed with an ancient power that echoed through their transformed bodies, binding them to the clearing, 
like prisoners of an ethereal cage. Panic surged within them, their instincts screaming to break free from the oppressive force that held them captive. The ghostly figure spoke in a voice that echoed through the clearing, a chorus of whispers that wormed its way into the minds of the friends. You, the keepers of the ancient gift, have awakened the slumbering darkness, it intoned, its words carrying the weight of centuries. A pact made in shadows binds you to this sacred ground. The friends, unable to speak in their animal forms, communicated through a shared sense of fear. The entity's words hinted at a malevolence that transcended the boundaries of their once cherished gift. The forest itself seemed to pulse with a malevolent energy, as if the very roots of the ancient trees reached out to ensnare them. As the ghostly figure circled the altar, the symbols etched into the stone glowed with an unholy light. The friends felt a surge of power, an unseen force pulling at the threads of their transformed selves. Their animal instincts clashed with a rising tide of fear and confusion. In a desperate attempt to break free, the friends strained against the spectral force that bound them. Yet, the more they resisted, the tighter the ethereal chains seemed to constrict. The haunting melody reached a fevered pitch, a cacophony of otherworldly notes that reverberated through the clearing. Suddenly, the forest erupted with a chorus of unnatural sounds, a symphony of whispers, howls, and cries that echoed from the depths of Raven's Hollow. Shadows danced on the periphery of the clearing, taking form and substance as ethereal creatures emerged from the darkness. The ghostly figure raised its hands, and the forest responded in kind. The creatures, born of shadows and ancient magic, converged on the altar, their eyes ablaze with malevolent light. The friends, still trapped in their animal forms, watched in horror as the creatures encircled them. As the haunting melody reached its zenith, the altar's glow intensified, casting an unholy radiance across the clearing. The friends, their once extraordinary gift, now a curse, faced a nightmare that transcended the boundaries of the forest, entangled in a web of ancient rituals and unspeakable horrors that threatened to consume them whole. The ethereal creatures, summoned by the ghostly figure, closed in on the friends with an unsettling precision. The air thickened with a palpable malevolence as the haunting melody continued to resonate through the forest, a sinister lullaby that seemed to weave itself into the very fabric of their transformed beings. The friends, still trapped in their animal forms, felt the spectral force pulling at the essence of their gift. Desperation clawed at them as they struggled against the unseen bonds that held them captive. The ethereal creatures, manifestations of ancient shadows, moved with an unnatural grace, their eyes fixated on the friends with a hunger that transcended the boundaries of the physical and the metaphysical. In the midst of the chaos, the ghostly figure chanted words in an arcane language, each syllable sending tremors through the clearing. The symbols on the altar pulsed in response, resonating with the dark energy that permeated Raven's Hollow. It became evident that the friend's extraordinary gift was intricately tied to an ancient ritual, a pact forged in shadows that had slumbered for centuries. As the friends strained against their otherworldly restraints, a sudden realization dawned upon them, a realization that the forest itself was a living entity, harboring secrets darker than they could have fathomed. 
the haunting melody, now a cacophony of dissonant notes, echoed the pain and suffering of those who had come before them. The ethereal creatures, guided by the ghostly figure's malevolent will, converged upon the friends. In a desperate attempt to break free, the friends summoned the remnants of their human consciousness, focusing on the memories that bound them together. The collective strength of their friendship, forged through years of shared experiences, surged through the spectral chains that ensnared them. The ghostly figure, momentarily taken aback by the unexpected resistance, faltered in its incantations. The haunting melody wavered, disrupted by the echoes of the friend's determination. In that fleeting moment, the forest seemed to recoil, as if the ancient trees themselves lamented the perversion of their sanctuary. With a surge of newfound strength, the friends pushed against the spectral force, breaking free from the ethereal chains that bound them to the clearing. The ghostly figure, now faced with defiance, recoiled into the shadows, its form dissipating like mist in the wind. The ethereal creatures, deprived of their master's command, dissipated into the night, leaving the friends alone in the moonlit clearing. The haunting melody gradually faded, replaced by the rustle of leaves and the distant hoot of an owl. The forest, once a realm of darkness, returned to an uneasy calm. As the friends reverted to their human forms, a somber understanding settled among them. The ancient gift that had once united them had become a conduit for a malevolence that sought to consume their very souls. They stood in the clearing, shaken by the horrors they had faced, their bond now tempered by the shadows that clung to their shared history. Raven's Hollow, forever changed by the events of that fateful night, bore witness to the lingering echoes of an ancient pact. The friends, scarred by the ordeal, departed the forest with a newfound awareness, a haunting reminder that some secrets are best left undisturbed, and that the line between extraordinary and cursed is a thin and treacherous thread. Thank you for diving into the spine-chilling mysteries with chills unveiled. If you've enjoyed the eerie tales and creepy narratives that send shivers down your spine, make sure to subscribe to our channel for more hair-raising content. Hit that notification bell so you never miss an unveiling of the unknown. Join the community of thrill seekers and let the darkness unfold. Subscribe now and let the nightmares continue.